when it comes to considering that treaty principles bill, it seems to me that you that we have um, we have the ACT Party and probably New Zealand First representing the majority uh, will of the people that we are all equal and we live in a liberal democracy. And on the other side of the argument, we have uh, the far left extremists, uh, the the ethno nationalist separatists represented by the Maori Party, the Green Party, and the Labour Party. But I think a significant question for New Zealand is whether or not the National Party can be cajoled and persuaded to represent the will of the people when it comes to that Treaty Principles Bill, or whether they will instead side uh, with those voices on the left. What do you think? I think that's a serious danger. Uh, Mr. Luxon has been very careful to avoid taking a strong position on this. And in fact, on the contrary, he said to David Seymour, we will not support your treaty principles bill beyond the um, first reading of the legislation. Now, of course, if it doesn't get beyond that, it doesn't get passed. And uh, I think he's been most regrettably weak on that issue. 